I'm well aware of, of my career and, and what I've done, but it never, I, you know, I don't know how to put this. It, I've never really, I've accepted it. I mean, I, for what it is, but I just, you know, like Roger Stallback comes up on stage. I, I still get goosebumps. That was my childhood uh, hero. Dallas Cowboys were my team. Last night in the hotel, Ed Tutal Jones comes up and says hello and is like, hey, man, he's actually talking to me. Uh, you know, I, that's, that's, that's how I feel. And I guess what I'm saying is I, I'm extremely thankful that I'm part of the group, but I don't necessarily feel like part of the group. And I, I mean that with the utmost respect. There's some things that, yeah, of course, I wish would have went our way. But I know I did everything I possibly could do. I played as hard as I possibly could play. And, and that's when, when people would ask me, are you nervous? Are you, are you uh, fearful? Whatever. I said, no, I'm not. I have you know, the utmost respect for the people who played before me as well as presently. Um, but I know I did all I could do. And that's all, that's all I can control. And so uh, if it comes, it comes. And I'll, I'll be extremely honored. But I'm, I'm really already, I was already honored to have had an opportunity to play in the National Football League because as a kid, all I ever dreamed of was to play pro football, to be Roger Stallback or to be Archie Manning. That's what I dreamed of. Um, I hated Terry Bradshaw, which I've told him that. Uh, he's okay now. Um, but that's all I dreamed of, and that's, that's it. I didn't dream of all the other stuff, and so it's been way more than I ever could imagine, and so I'm extremely thankful for that. We'll be right back.